Hello class, welcome to the Minute Math YouTube channel. Please hit the subscribe button below and share our videos. You can also find great math content and links to all of our videos at www.minutemathtutor.com. All right now, enjoy the lesson. Hi, I'm Sean Gann, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about simplifying variable expressions. We're going to simplify each expression. So, if I was given this expression, negative 4p minus 1 minus 6p, okay? Well, the first thing I want to do is this minus sign, I'm going to distribute within the parentheses, okay? There's nothing that we can simplify in the parentheses, but we can distribute that negative, right? So this minus is like a negative going in there. So we have negative 4p, okay? Negative times 1 is a negative 1. So we have, you know, right, let's go plus a negative 1. And then negative times a negative here with a 6p makes it a positive. So we have positive 6p. Okay, and so now we have negative 4p plus a negative 1 plus 6p, okay? Well, now we have to combine our like terms. Hopefully we can see just the letter p's are like terms, right, that we can see here. So negative 4p plus 6p is a 2p. Adding a negative is the same thing as subtraction, so we have minus 1. And so my final answer here is 2p minus 1. Quick recap, <clears throat> we're given negative 4p minus, in parentheses, 1 minus 6p. Well, I distributed the minus sign into the parentheses first, and then from there, I combined my like terms. 6p and negative 4p were 2p, plus a negative 1 is a minus 1. So again, final answer, 2p minus 1. Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, the creator of Minute Math. And if you like this video, please hit the like button that's right there. If you have a mathematical question, just add it to the comment section below. And lastly, if you want to see more videos just like this one, hit subscribe. It's right there. But as always, thanks for watching.